Good morning to hey, you. Good morning. Ladies, good morning. We're Colors. like a bunch of Skittles. I know. Right. We're, we're, yeah, we're very and colorful cheery. bunch And I've insisted that no other man. Okay. No and created no a little hurricane. hurricane called Sandy. I just love I'm in the window seat. I watch y'all. Like, we made it to the window seat. You did. Oh, I'm not on the outside looking in. I know. <laughs> Security, look who let me in here. Let's get going then on our takes, okay, because you have to give us our opinion on, on this one, especially take one. What's in a name? So it's official, of course. You all have been reporting Jessica. A Beal and I really think it's great. I'm a traditional girl to do it. Before I met my husband, I thought Kit Pitt for Brad Pitt had a great <laughs> ring. Don't we all practice the yeah, last Kitty Pitt? Perfect yes. ring too. Remember it when you're in seventh grade? I know. Write you're writing it out with, yeah, I mean, with hearts all around it. it. But then life takes over and you get a little more practical sometimes. So now I keep my maiden name on air and my married name Sally. To my darling husband. It boils yeah. down to and I don't know. That's a good name. Schmuckler. Just yeah, yeah. Schmuckler. Yeah. That would not be good. Right. Beal's not that bad. Yeah. No, right? Beale's good. Schmuckler. Schmuckler. Well, Beale's good, but You do want to kind of keep that and have your own thing, and then you go home and be Mrs. Timberlake. But I, I think it is getting less common for women to take their husband's names. I have a lot of right. friends who are married, and they have kept their, their maiden names. But then when you have kids, what do you do? Right. So haven't you heard this? Com I've heard they, this, where they yeah, combine they they create combine a new name. Don't they tell me that's getting into names. Yeah. So, I mean, as, hey, I'm, I'm just glad. Leave Kelly. We'll mix it up. I'm glad Jessica Timberlake is now doing that. All right, let's get to our take two, a car designed for a woman. We want you to take Burbank and a Mary Kay pink little car there. The fit she just blowing that Wait, good stuff away. Sometimes people get irritated when things that are marketed to women, whether it's a laptop or whether it's a car, that it's always pink, pink. and My always God. has these frilly little touches. But personally, I like those frilly yeah. little touches. You do? What about the w women like a big watch, don't they? Don't you like yeah, a big I like a big watch. watch. To yeah. wear for us, you mean. Yes. So I yeah. think we can all have the same thing here. Like of a minivan. Right. That's, that's what women want. That's what women That offends me. Can't go yeah, anywhere I don't want without to your appliances. Yes. Yes. If it's a pink that. washer and dryer, right. then we'd be okay with you that. You answer your iron while you're driving. I think it's the marketing. I used to have a Honda CRV. I think they designed it with women in mind because there's a great spot to put your purse. Right. Don't you? I hate putting the purse in the front seat and yeah. then somebody gets in, it's like, excuse my purse, and then you gotta throw it in the and back. And that's another thing. Why inviting this? We're no, all Billy, together. Three. Billy, Billy, what's Bush, in your take purse? Three. My purse? Um, Don't get him started. My phone. Concealer. Yes. <laughs> my <laughs> my <laughs> under eye. Hairspray? <laughs> hairspray? <laughs> my hairspray. He's got great hair. An uh, apple and a hairbrush. My hair piece. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you want all to right, do take three for us? How Billy? old is too old? An 18 year old kid comes around, he's got an unbelievably cool costume. He gets candy from me. If he's mailing it in, no. Eighth grade's too young. How old are you in eighth grade? Eighth grade is 13. They can't put the band in Indiana. They're, they're on the night. I like little toilet paper bombs. I was really Don't. getting into it. Right? That was, that, the only part. that was only if you got the bag of popcorn. Don't give the bag of popcorn or the apple. Setting or the yeah. toothbrush. Or the apple. Don't do the toothbrush. The toothbrush. Oh, yeah. Or we used to get, there was a guy on our street who gave out pennies. Huh. Which is, I mean, Did nice. Whip but whip it back to <laughs> Inflation, yeah. quarters. <laughs> you know, it all comes around, though. And up for your show? I'm going to be a pickle. Well, no, pickle with my kids. Honey boo boo. Yeah. But I'm not sure for this. Or I might be broccoli spears and do green hair and like a naughty schoolgirl outfit. Oh. Speaking, speaking of Halloween <laughs> costumes, Kit, let's take a look at Google's team. top list. Kit. Oh. Is that a video game? It is game a video like game, that? yeah. All right. Big yeah. Bird at number six. Yeah. Oscar the Grouch is going to be fair. Apparently and Binders of Women. Bird has been flying oh, off the shelves. Look at Honey Go Boo Boo down there, number 11. I know. And I have very women. sore memories of Honey Boo Boo. She paid us a, vis uh, a visit. I know. I know. She threw stuff at you, right? Pillow. She did. She hit me with pillows, and then she had uh, two two dolls that doing things. That I think you should be Sugar Bear, my baby daddy. He's from the South. <laughs> yeah, exactly. you, can, yeah. you can bring it, I right? I right in there very nice. <laughs> We've cleaned her up a little bit. She looks great. You look Shine me up. It's so good to have you here in our little window seat. Will you come back? Yes. Thank you, please. Yes. Thanks, girl. Right, it's been fun having and you guys I love outside. the bangs. Thank you. Oh, yeah, I know. They're good, right? All right. Coming up next, rock a the vote.